We now go in the huddle, brought to you by the Myriad Group of Ameriprise Financial Advisors, John Everson and Phil McCoy. Stop by 1270 Winchester Avenue or give them a call at 304-263-4343. We're now joined by Shepard wide receiver Cam Dorner. Cam, a uh, big game for you, over 200 yards in your first game back from injury. Uh, what were you trying to do out there against Edinburgh to exploit the defense? Uh, I was just gonna. I was just trying to do my job. I thought my coaches and my teammates put me in a great position to make plays. And I thought it was just a result of good offensive line play, good quarterback play. With that injury that you were dealing with in week one, you unfortunately couldn't play in the first game of the year. Uh, how did it feel to get back out there? And what were some things you were doing to work your way back? Uh, I was just doing a lot of rehab with the training staff, and they were getting me right. I was dealing with a lower back issue, but I'm good now, and I'm happy to be out there, that's for sure. How do you feel about this wide receiver core this year? A lot of new faces. You're one of the few returners uh, from last year. How have you tried to step up as one of the leaders in the locker room? Um, I've just I've just tried to be uh, pretty vocal and just lead in practice. We got a lot of guys that can make plays. Uh, a lot of new guys that can make plays. JT, Barry, uh, Butter, Ethan, Big B, Will. Those guys, Cordell as well. Those guys are all young guys that can make plays and go out there and probably have just as good as the game that I did last game. So we got a lot of guys that can make plays, and it's it's fun and contagious to be around a lot of guys like that for sure. Cal this week, a team that. Gave you guys a tough game last year. What have been some things you've seen out of their defense so far? Uh, they, they're definitely fast. They're physical, very, very physical, probably a lot more physical than the last team we just played. And they're going to get after it. I know they're, they're well coached and well disciplined, and they're going to come. They're going to they're bring it, that's for sure. What are some things you guys want to work on as an offense heading into this game? Um, obviously, we're going to eliminate, we're going to try to eliminate the turnovers, eliminate the things that, the bad things that we can't control, like the fumbles and the interceptions and the drops, that's for sure. And if we play like we did last game and eliminate the turnovers, I think we would, we would have a pretty good shot to be a good team. Now here with Shepard Rams defensive tackle, Jack Baxter. Jack, a good win for you guys over Edinburgh. What have been some things that you took away from that game? Um, I mean, the few things I've taken away from the game is uh, as a defense, like we had a good game, it was a win, came out of the win, but we got a lot of work to do. We got a lot of guys, we're working together, and we just got to keep pushing and keep looking for, looking to the next game and working. For you, in that rotation with that interior defensive line, kind of you, Muley, and uh, Bednarski as well, how do you feel like you three kind of complement each other and bring some different skill sets to the defense? Yeah, they're both great guys and even better players. And I mean, as a group, I think we just work really well together. When one of us is sl slacking down a little bit, the other one picks, up, picks it up for the other one. So I mean, I think it's just a good group and we have a really good chemistry and work well together. So I think in general, we just complement each other's styles. And overall, how do you feel about the defense and how it's grown? Um, obviously, you guys gave up a few big plays last week, but when the moments got tough, you came through and, and got the stops you needed to. I feel really good about our defense. I think we got a lot of growing to do still. I think we've grown a lot so far and we got a lot more work to do. And, you know, each week we're going to improve and get better every week until the season ends. Cal PA this week, one of the top programs in the PSAC year in and year out. What are some things you've seen out of their offense that you'll have to slow down? Um, they're really explosive offense, like to throw the ball. And when they get the chance, they'll run the ball and gash us. So we got to come out. We got to play hard, play physical. It's going to be a real test for us this week. Any other goals for you uh, personally headed into the game? Uh, nothing really specific. I'm just going to keep working, play my best, and put everything I got on the field. That concludes our player interviews portion of the W. Harley Miller Systems pregame show. When we return, we will have more. This is Shepherd University Rams football on TV 10.